Hello again, everyone. It's Vince Moore from TradeWinds.com, and this is our update for September 6, 2016. Let's take a quick look at today's markets. Well, we saw a bit of movement, and uh, it was up, is it was to the upside. Excuse me. The Dow by the end of the session was up 46 points, while the S&P 500 was up six and a half. And the Nasdaq moved on to fresh new highs, all-time highs. That is up 26 points. So hopefully this is the start of something much bigger to come. You know, as we as we head into mid-September, uh, as I mentioned yesterday, we should see a bit more volume. So hopefully that will get us going. The Russell was also up slightly. TLT had a nice bounce up a little over a point. Now, the biggest day here was for gold. Gold uh, up very, very strongly, up 27 points in today's session on decent volume as well. And uh, this is a, a contract that really is just getting started, if, I, I think. If you look at the weekly chart here, beautiful, beautiful formation. Nice, strong upward trend. We have nice, strong momentum. Look at the slope in our 20 period moving average. You know, we had a, a nice orderly pullback here recently. And... We, you know, we had that nice bounce off that 20 period moving average and now follow through today closing near its highs. I think this is headed much higher. And so we'll continue to follow that closely. And crude today finished slightly higher, about 40 cents higher, was much higher again uh, earlier in the session before retreating. Now, I wanted to share something with you and, and I'm going to use Netflix as an example you know, a lot of times you can use multiple time frames to confirm entries, but sometimes it's just best to use the higher time frames for an overall trend. And let's start with the monthly time frame here on Netflix. And I mean, there's nothing better looking than this. A beautiful, sharp uh, momentum higher. Recently had a significant pullback here. And now if I zoom in here, you can see right here, let me actually uh get this for you here let me get my drawing tool out right in here is right in here hopefully you can see it this bullish engulfing sign now this is on the monthly chart so this happened over the last couple of months but once we broke that high here in the last few days that confirms that reversal signal so we should be headed back up towards these highs here just above 130 and we're currently sitting around 96 so that would be a very significant move here you know about 30 percent or so that is extremely significant now if we look at the weekly chart of netflix you know pretty flat right now overall let me uh remove this actually <clears throat> um let me just get this out of the way completely flat here right now but you know, you can see it could be turning right here. And there's certainly a lot of room to move. And if we look at the daily chart on Netflix, let me zoom back in here. We recently had this island reversal pattern. And again, very strong day today. Closing near its highs. This really looks poised for a much bigger move to the upside. So sometimes you can use those same setups that you use on the daily time frame or on intraday time frames on the longer term uh, time frames. And so an example like this, when it sets up on the monthly, you know that um, you're in for several months of upside. But obviously, if you come back to the daily time frame, there's going to be a lot of back and forth along the way and many, many opportunities to jump on, on board and ride that wave higher. So Keep an eye out, but certainly Netflix looks like it's headed much higher from here. Okay, that's about it for now. Enjoy the rest of your day, and we will see you on our next update.